So how long should a woman wait for a man to commit? I think that a woman should wait seven years for a man to commit. Seven years? Ah, those were the good old days. We've all heard it said that things aren't what they used to be when it comes to black relationships. The question is, is it talk or is it true? My name is Tamarat McConan. I'm a filmmaker. I decided to go on a journey to get some answers on the current state of black relationships in America. The qualities women look for when considering a man are financial stability, number one, um, sense of humor, swag. Black women look for swag. What do you think is important? Does he have to have a uh, swagger? You know, that may not be as important as the way he treats you. I'm not saying that he's gonna walk out with his pants hanging and looking thuggish, but I want him to have the thug in him. Nobody wants to have to hide guns and like worry about drugs and cops. Or Rikers Island buses, yeah, they're I'm not, not attractive. Like, a businessman works for me because at least he's using his mind and he can make us some money. And that's just as protective. There's definitely a larger percentage of black women in colleges compared to black men. Why do you think this lopsided ratio exists? I know that um, growing up where I grew up, there aren't a lot of men from my high school who made it to college. If you look at uh, African-American family dynamics, um, it's usually a matriarch. For instance, I, I know my grandmother, I don't know my grandfather on, on either side, you know? It's interesting the kind of men I meet. I either meet a man who is really lame, or they're really, um, they're really player-like. The guys that are dating, they tend to, you know what I'm saying, have all they want out there. It's like all you can eat. There's so many females out there, man, shut they're not trying to shack up with just one meal, man. They have an entree of a broad. Some guys will do things on purpose just to piss you off to see you get an attitude. And then, you know, when you stab them a little bit, then they want to call the police. We need to take care of our women, man. We need to do more. We need to love them, adore them, uh, shower them with gifts, tell them we love them every day. I don't fear strong black women. I uh, embrace them. I embrace it and all the money that comes with it. Now, uh, as long as <laughs> what's going to make it equal is the respect, the love, and caring that the people share. That's what's going to make it equal, not the money. My goal is I'm going to have it with or without him. You're going to be in that castle I'm going to be in that castle and living the dream with or without him. That's right. You know, relationships aren't about, like, what we project in our mind, about somebody coming to save you and take you away. The brothers are not the enemy, and the sisters are not the enemy. We just have to gain some kind of understanding. 